Praise the Lord, this is Bishop Ernest Johnson and I am celebrating 61 years of life and 47 years of ministry. I'm here in Las Vegas, Nevada. And look at this beautiful pool right here. I'm gonna show you some close-ups. But the Bible says, days of a man are short, but they're full of trouble. Amen. And so the thing is, we live such a short life, 60, 70 years is a very short time. But when we ask the question, why are we here? Why exactly are we here? One, we're here to discover that we were in the spirit, we were in the mind of God, and he sent us here to understand who we are and what we can do, what our abilities are, our minds to think, because the Bible says God made us in his own image and his own likeness. So we are some of the only few or the human beings are the only ones that could make our own decisions. And why is it that Satan came to mess that up? Because the Bible says we love him because he first loved us. So how do we know that God loves us? Because not only did Jesus die on the cross for us, amen, but he gave us a choice to choose between Satan and God between true religion and false religion. And so man understood that he is so wise that he could do beauty like this in Las Vegas. See the waterfall and see the water down there? It's beautiful, amen. So the first thing is for us to discover who we are, to be named, to be identified. And then the second thing is know who he is. Amen. To know who Jesus Christ is. The Bible says, how shall they hear? Or how shall they believe in him whom they've not heard? And how shall they hear without a preacher? And how can he preach except he be sent? When God sends the preacher, he's going to deliver Jesus to you. And he's going to preach what Jesus preached. And what did Jesus preach? He said, repent for the kingdom of God is at hand. So any preacher that's not telling you to repent and not telling you to repent before God and not telling you to believe God is not preaching the gospel of Jesus Christ. The gospel means the good news, amen, of the life, the death, the burial, and the resurrection of Jesus Christ. And the good news is you can be free from bondage. You can be free from drugs. You can be free from sin. Because he whom the Son sets free is free indeed. So get free today. Get out of those false religions and come to the real one, which is Jesus Christ. Jesus is the answer. Accept him today. Repent. Be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of your sin, and you shall receive the gift of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Repent today and have a better life in Christ. God bless you.